we operate long run ranch beef. Basically when you wake up, you start thinking what you need to do for the cattle that day. Feeding, checking waters, checking welfare on cattle. We are a straight grain farm. We've been in this location since 1965 where my parents started the farm off and I'm the second generation on this site. We're a beef processor. I always love the fact that I can know every person in this plant, being able to greet people and say goodbye to them and actually strap on safety gear and go up and cut meat with them. We went through a lot to build this store and at times it was like, why are we doing this? That day we opened and you see everybody roll in and you see how happy they are, makes it all worth it. located three kilometers west of Crossfield. All of our beef is 21 day dry aged, raised by us, processed at a small facility and then brought back to us where we store it in our um, walk-in freezer on the ranch. Once you order it, I'm the one who delivers it to you as well. With the close proximity to Airdrie and Calgary and Cochrane and some of those communities, there's a pretty good customer base there to reach out to. We're in Rocky View County, we're east of Crossfield. The craft brewers, in a lot of cases, use Alberta maltsters. We directly know where our barley has gone to it and even which beer might even have our name on it. We're here at our acreage just uh, north of Airdrie. Honestly, the Alberta product is key. We deal directly from our own product to our customer or we buy it from other fellow farmers at a very fair price. We have like from meat, eggs to fudge, all made within 100 kilometers from here. The majority of our cattle are Alberta. I'd say there's customers that are doing business with us because we're local. Farm to Table allows us to shrink the job and the relationship that we think is so large, and it brings it back to a really close-knit connection. It really brings back the personal touch. Technology in agriculture is a fast-moving target. I think what we're going to see is not necessarily a dislocation or a removal of jobs, but maybe a description that changes on their job. Our small feedlot that we have at home, all the cattle get scanned in. You know when they were scanned in, how much feed they've had every day, what they're gaining, if they've been treated with anything, what they were treated with and when. The plant itself. It was built in, I believe, 2003 in response to BSE. It's totally unique, totally different, with the emphasis on animal safety, worker safety, and food safety. There's not another plant like it on the harvest side of the business. Technology is becoming so much better in so many ways. My water consumption five years ago would be about 20,000 liters a day, and right now I'm watering about 20,000 liters a week. We use solar watering systems. We just recently got one through Rocky View County's grant program. It helps us every day with making sure that the cattle have clean water all the time. A normal plant like this would use somewhere close to a half million gallons a day. So we operate at about 5% of the water needs of what a typical plant was with our recycling system. The reality behind sustainability is that it's a word that literally describes what our forefathers have been doing for many years. We know that our families, or anybody that follows us, is going to need to have the land in as good a shape, if not better, than we received it. We are always working towards having something that we can pass on. I think that's with every agricultural producer, though. They're always basically thinking of the next generation down the road. It's exceeded everything we could have ever asked for. It's been busy. We're now just looking for future expansion to make it more of a destination spot for people of the area and Calgary and Alberta. This is the prime spot. It's a growing area. The local farmers, the local support. Honestly, I couldn't ask for better. It's a nice place to live. The soil's nice and dark, and it's really productive land. I would strongly urge anybody who's considering developing a business to consider Rocky View.